Could Dayton be the next Hollywood? Don't put it past the Gem City, home to innovators, creators, and historical figures alike. Dayton will now be home to a major production company. New Center 7's Candace Price tells us what this could mean for the community beyond just the film buffs. A film production company says they're going to put their headquarters at this location behind me in Dayton. is said to be a game changer for the film industry here. Huge, huge deal. For more than just the filmmakers here. You know, they'll be renting cars, they'll be buying coffee, they'll be, you know, eating at our local restaurants. Which means more money. The uh, Morgan Freeman trailer for the Dave Chappelle, The Closer, they were in town two days, they spent $50,000. It also means more jobs. The number of people it takes to run the lines, the electric, the gaffers that are involved, the catering companies, the transportation needs. 1913 Studios plans to make 12 to 15 films a year. They've already purchased this more than 200,000 square foot facility on Springfield Street in Dayton. What they will specialize in is smaller films that are three to five million dollars, which in the scheme of movies, that's not huge. And they know that they'll get a lot of first-time producers and stuff. First-time producers like the students of the Tom Hanks Motion Picture School at Wright State University. We tell our students all the time, like, you don't have to be in L.A. or New York or Atlanta to, like, work in movies uh, to make things that are substantial. Two of 1913's founders have roots here in Dayton, and that's why Grigsby says they understand the value. It's so, you know, so affordable here, and the work ethic of the people in the Midwest is amazing. So the timeline for the studio to open is going to be late 2023, but they say that could change. In Dayton, Candace Price, New Center 7.